you all are about to be in for a treat today. So please do sit back and enjoy the video. In this first clip, a guy makes his date pay for her dinner. Take a look. All right, you guys. Did you really come back with two separate checks? Yeah, that's what I was asking you. You're really gonna make me pay? No. Well, anyways, man, here go to she's not gonna give me what? No, that's that's crazy. Wait a minute, is it me or is that waitress trying to instigate the whole situation? Wow, keep watching. Wait, wait. are you? I'm gonna pay the fifteen. At least they're sure kneecap. You see that's your problem. You don't want to. That's your problem. Yeah, he's really making me pay, you guys. Hey, how you get home? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? You're f***ing taking me home. You're taking me home. You got gas? No. You want to give that to uh, the ride? No. You're taking me home. I think you'll heat up the food. Alright, you guys. He's not making me... Um, He's making me pay for my food because I won't have him. That's a sad shame. Look at this man. Don't ever go out with him. Don't give him your number. Just run. Y'all hoes is hungry. So this is just an advice to women who are asked on a date. Let's say you were asked on a date. I think it's appropriate for you to take your own money to the date in order for you to pay for your own food. And also, if possible, take your own ride with you for reasons like this. In this next clip, a guy confronts his girl about getting her tubes tied without informing him. But you will not believe her response to this. Please take a look. You just got your tubes tied without even talking to me about it. Why would you do that? I mean, we already have, like, we have children, like, technically they're not biological. Those not my biological kids. I know they're not yours, but, like, you're a great father figure to them. I can so be a great father, but I want to be a great father to my own actual child. I mean, my biological child. I want an actual child of my own that I can say that is really my own. I mean, that's valid, but at this point, the decision has been made. What? What you mean the decision has been made? Why wouldn't you talk to me about it first? I mean, Why would you just up well, and do it? I don't even have a ring on my finger, so it's just like, what's the point? And I feel like I'm you don't got a ring on your finger, but you in this house though. Okay, and oh hell no, the nerve of this girl telling the guy that she doesn't have a ring on her finger, but he's so good enough to help her raise her own kids. Unbelievable. I think she has to go. What you mean? What's going on? I mean, it's just yes, I could be a great I, father, but what's made, going like, on? A rash decision, but the decision is final, and I feel good with what I did. Like, don't make me feel bad or try to. But why wouldn't you like talk to your? To why wouldn't you mind? talk to the person you're supposed to be spending your life with? I mean, it was just really about like a, a situation minute, that know? permanent. I mean, I've been talking to like family members, and I and, already have children. I know I don't want to have any more. But children, I don't have so a child, they, so you. You genuinely just thinking about yourself. I mean, if that's is what how you're you telling feel, me. If that's how you feel. But that's how it feel? It. I'm telling you how it is. But that's not it. Like, you know, I just have a lot going on. I don't want to have any more children. I'm fine. Like, we can barely. I'm. I'm trying to make ends meet with my situation right now. Make and ends just, meet. Like, it just doesn't make sense. We are a team. We are a collective. I got, I got but it, why right? wouldn't you actually talk to me about something that permanent? We're talking about is, it now. No, permanent. this is what. No, hold on. I mean, you you talking about talking point, about it now? No. You have a decision to make. You can either stay or you can leave. Wow. That is so wrong on so many levels. At least you should have let him know how you feel about it. Oh, I'm definitely leaving. All right, bye. I'm definitely leaving, but well, why would you make that type of decisions? When you understand I was saying her name, these kids' lives, why would you make a decision that permanent, not even talking to me about it, not knowing if I want a child of my own? Why would you think that's fair that's in a relationship like this? But you laying on the bed that I paid for. I mean, the bed not even that comfortable. So you, so you don't want to be here? It's better than living on the street? I mean, that's, yeah. Oh, you'd rather do that? 
Why would you make a decision like that? I mean, it was like I talked to a lot of people before I made it. I granted, I didn't How you don't talk to your man, though? You ain't talking to all these other folks. You ain't talking to your man, though. Like, why does that I mean, Why does that even it's, matter? It's my body at the end of the day. It's your body. It's children. Like, that's what it is. No, I don't and have a child that is mine. Well, that is biological mine. That is, that is not fair. Because you already stepped up to the plate. You do a great job, and this is where I'm at. No, that's not fair. I'm going to be honest. Like, you just, you tripping, and you big tripping. And to be honest, we won't be able to continue this. We already got two kids. Like, like times are rough. Like Yeah, times are real session, rough. The inflation. It's just so so much. Like, yes, but you could have said, talk to me about it. You, you could have told me about this. But you can't afford a child. I can't afford a child? Do you not see where you're staying at? Yes, we we just won't be able to continue this. We won't be able to stay in a relationship. You're going to have to do it on your own now because guess what? You see her make a decision so, this permanent. Like I just broke up with you and now you break up with me. Come on now. It seems like this young lady has already made up her mind and is willing to let this good guy go. But my advice to him is to let her go. Go find someone else. Who is willing to have his own children because she seems to be kind of selfish. In this next clip, y'all won't believe this. A guy catches his girlfriend cheating with, guess who? His best friend. Take a look at this drama. What the Hold on, first of all. What the is? Hey, no, calm down. Calm down, my. What the f is? Bro, what you talking about? What the f is? This your, this your friend? That's my mother friend. The f you mean this your friend? Bro, what you tripping for? Out of this your friend. This is this we on, bro? What you talking about? This is we on, bro. You my f day one, but you chilling with my b. What the f what you talking about? We ain't doing nothing. We trying to surprise you. Bro, I just zoomed in and see y'all kissing like five times. I ain't f out of here. Bro, you did. I seen this. Bro, I'll spit out you, bro. Stop playing with me, bro. I'm not no f goofy. I'm not a goofy, bro. I'll spit out you. Best friend. I'm sorry, but this dude was never your best friend. Wow, this is wrong on every level, and I think both friend and girlfriend are both trifling, and I don't think he needs both of them in his life. And as a matter of fact. I think he should just cut both of them off. Period. Please take your time to watch this clip of a young woman who was put out of her home because she cheated. But guess what? She doesn't consider what she did. Cheating. Take a look. Yeah, yeah. Tell them what you did, though. Tell them what you did. All right. So I had a girl and... Oh. And he's yeah, doing yeah, the most, yeah, get, like, yeah, tell the doing the most because I, you, because you get tripped I, up on your words because you ain't no, telling the No, because truth. you're doing the tell most. Me. You're doing the most. Are you seriously throwing my stuff? Why are you putting all my stuff out the door? What are you doing? Because you have to leave. You're not staying here. You think you finna disrespect me like I'm this. not staying here. No. But you, this is my house. But you finna leave. What? You finna leave if you're not gonna respect me, though. That's what you're. I to told do. you. I was honest. This is what, look, and people want honesty, right? This is, this is what you get for being honest. The, the like, stuff, are you about put my the, stuff the, down? I'm the, not going nowhere though. The little stuff you do have, but I'm not can... going. All <laughs> little stuff I have, <laughs> really, yeah. really. To, what are you doing? You. No, I, I can't, can't believe, believe you. you. Look at you. Look at you, him. Bro. Look, look. Insecure. I'm, insecure. I'm insecure. In, I did not cheat oh, on you. It was, a, it was a woman. I didn't. 
Yes. It was a woman. That's yep. why it, that's why it's not cheating. And yes. I'm insecure because of that. Yes, man up. Man up. Is this girl for real? Just because someone is kind doesn't give you a right to be taken advantage of his kindness. I think this guy needs a loyal woman in his life. Keep watching. Are you serious right now, bro? Are you going ballistic, putting all my stuff by the door? Because you think this like, is a what's game. Wrong with you? you think this is really a game. I can't believe you. I a game. Believe. I can't. You, you, you really need to get out. Keep I put my you, stuff back in the closet. You need to get out for put real. my stuff back. I can't believe that you think. What and you I can't did believe that cheating. you're doing all of this. And you calling me insecure. Yeah, insecure. And the fact insecure. that you're shows me that you have no remorse and no respect for me at all. None at all. Bro, she doesn't have respect for you at all. And the fact that she's recording you. Knowing quite well that she is the one in the wrong beats me. Also, calling him insecure, I'm done. Keep watching. No, I want you to see how you look. Because doing the most. Because I had a little too much to drink and had oh, a little true. fun with a friend. Okay, and you call it fun, and I'm right. Yeah. And you think this, you think I, you think I'm supposed to be okay with it? There's no respect in our relationship. It's and I no respect. I was honest. Are you serious right now? Keith, come pick my stuff up. Come pick my stuff up. Come, what it? Come, put put my stuff down. Are you serious? Put my stuff on. Can you put my stuff down? Bro, I cannot believe you. You gonna be the one picking it up. So it's cool. It's cool. You gonna be the one putting it back. You gonna be the one putting it back. I'm not going nowhere. I'm not going anywhere. And get that file out of my face, bro. For real, I'm not playing with you. What are you gonna do about it? What you gonna do about it? Bro, you need to get out, bro. Get out. You need to get out. I'm not no, you are time. so insecure. Bro. The gaslighting on this one is absolutely insane. And I think accountability is a huge problem these days. On the flip side, I think he's absolutely right about his reaction to her disloyalty. Dude, I would advise that you run. And never look back. Please take your time to watch this clip to the end. And please let me know in the comment section. If McDonald's truly got jokes. Take a look. Hey yo. Is it just me or do I really see a strip of cheese on my sandwich? I'm at McDonald's by the way. Like why they got a strip of cheese on my sandwich? It's not even a half slice of cheese is a strip of cheese like i haven't had a fish fillet in hella long but for real this is what y'all doing now mcdonald's a strip of cheese i'm about to go give me a real slice of cheese on my sandwich hold on hold on real quick <laughs> that's crazy a strip of cheese on my fillets old fish man. Hold on. welcome to mcdonald's are you doing my back today no okay okay hit you i just came through the drive through like three minutes ago and i ordered a filet -O fish uh you guys put a strip of cheese on my sandwich i wanted a full slice of cheese is it okay if i get a full slice of cheese i'll even pay for it i just want a full slice of cheese on my sandwich oh yeah sure okay thank you do i pay for it or what uh let me go ask to make sure um just pull the first window all right thank you I might give me a free slice of cheese. <laughs> hey, I don't really even really eat McDonald's. I don't know why I was craving a um, fish sandwich today, but I don't know. This came out of nowhere. So I was like, I ain't have one in hella long. Let me just go ahead and get one. Cause I really don't really eat nothing. I don't eat nothing from McDonald's like that. Like not even the McChickens no more. Like those even make my stomach hurt. Let me stop talking.
about McDonald's from Ronald McDonald come out the cuts and sneak me. Uh, um, do you want us to shoot McDonald's sandwich or do you want us to add cheese to it? You can just add cheese to it if you if it's not if it's easier. Okay. Whatever's easier. You want to add cheese to it? Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. So, hey, everybody in the comment box, say me if you damn near get into a wreck pulling out of McDonald's trying to eat some French fries. Why everybody eat French fries pulling out? Like, right, you are? oh, thank I you. It's okay. Can I ask a couple uh, ketchups too? If yeah, you don't mind. Okay. No, uh, thank you. Hey, I feel kind of heavy. Did they give me two? They must have gave me two sandwiches. All right, we back. Back where we started. All right. Take this seatbelt off. Right. Woo, back to a heavy. What the hell? Why they give you all these damn napkins? Look how much napkins they gave me, y'all. What the f is that? Oh, uh, wow. Are you serious? I just asked for a little bit of ketchup. Are you serious? All that ketchup? I asked for a couple packets of ketchup. What? <laughs> okay, they got the funnies. All right, let's go. Let's get this fish sandwich started. See what they get. What the? F what? Are you? Ah, they got the funnies. Look. Really? Are you serious? Okay. Yeah, I'm I already had it. Been having a bad day today too. What's up? Hold on. They think they hella funny, right? They think they so funny. Watch what I'm about to do. Let's see how funny they think they is after I do this. They got me fucked up. Hold on, man. Yo. First of all. This question is for those who probably have eaten McDonald's filet or fish before. Did you get the same type of cheese on your sandwich? And also, just to let you know, I will be posting the updates when the guy posts a story time. Please take your time to watch this clip of this employee who got fired for this take a look something informal i don't need anything you know crazy out of here so i just need to, to let you know how do you clock in do you clock in Is on it? your computer on your phone or do you clock in when you get to the station in the morning well the policy say on the computer so what's the problem okay so i'm asking you where do you clock in if the policy say computer i'm gonna tell you computer you're going to tell me, computer, or are you going to tell me where you actually clock in? Because the last, let me pull it up on this thing. So the last 10 clock-ins show that you're clocking on your phone. How many? 10. Okay. So the last 10 clock-ins, the punch-ins, they've been showing that they've been through the phone app. I probably was in the parking lot. Okay, well, I knew you were going to say something like that, so I went ahead and I pulled up the cameras for the past 10 shifts. Um, and and I'm you're assume, not... If you're watching me you're on camera ready. for no reason, that's the problem. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? That's not for no reason. That's what I said. Whenever you first that's applied job. here, and if, let me let me just reiterate your memory. When you first had this interview here, oh, one of the your lunch was done two minutes ago. 
whenever we sat down on that interview, do you recall, we mentioned you are going to be working under close surveillance, and if that's something that you were uncomfortable with, this is not the job for you. I've been working for y'all five years. Do you think I remember anything that I told okay. y'all? Well, that's, we, I'm not violating no. anything by doing that. I was just making sure that this is all of today and clearly. So where was I when I clocked in? Where you seen me at? I'm not sure, but I don't feel like pulling your ABL location either. So I'm just, I, again, I'm not trying to make this a big deal, Brown. I'm not trying to make this so a big deal. So what you want me to do? Go on and tell I'm me just so I trying to bring this to your attention. I need you to stop clocking in on your phone when you're not physically at the station at 553. Okay. You need to be physically at the station, pulling in. Sure, you can clock in on your phone if that's what you have to do to, to get your clock in on time. But if I pull that surveillance, you need to be in that parking lot. So let me ask you this. In. When y'all wake me up out of my bed and I get up, I start washing cleaning my face putting on my clothes i don't i'm working in so i clock, i be clocking in oh my goodness who clocks in from their home i guess she didn't know that she just implicated herself unbelievable keep watching that's not part of this contract 553 you need to be at the station in the back clock in if it weren't for y'all i wouldn't be getting right? up so soon as i wake up i clock in that's all I'm asking. Like I said, I'm okay. trying to make this a big deal, Brown. Okay, this I got This is a lot bigger of a deal, but again, I try to look out for my employees, and I am trying I, to come I'm, to you okay. before I bring this to anybody. Next time. Here. We could squash it now. I'm just it's washed. It's washed. It's washed. Thank okay, you. long, long, so I can, finish, can I finish eating? You, your lunch break is over, but you can finish whatever you're doing. Man, I cannot believe that in this day and age, you still have people out there behaving like this. This is unreal. Wow.